Guyana and the rest of the world are celebrating International Day for the Elimination of Violence Against Women. To this end, Wintress White, member of NGO group Red Thread, feels that there's lots of window dressing on the issue. She was speaking during an interview with this newscast. I don't think we're serious enough. We only window dress sometimes. When this thing gets so bad and everybody starts think. All we do is win the dress. You ask me, in this big whole Guyana, this white Guyana, why don't we have many shelters for battered women and their children? Come them this scant, I know about one, personally, and there's none that I know about government led. And that one, you could stay a year, six months to a year, um, and you can't stay more, right? So. Where is the skills training? Where is the, 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 the kind of counseling? I'm not saying that the shelters don't have, um, help and shelter don't have for counseling. But what, where, where's the aftercare? Where, where's the support? Where, nothing, absolutely nothing. The theme for International Day for the Elimination of Violence Against Women is Unite Activism to End Violence Against Women and Girls. This year's campaign is a 16-day initiative starting on International Day for the Elimination of Violence Against Women and concluding on the International Human Rights Day on December 10th. According to White Red Thread over the years has done lots of work across the country to spread awareness of violence against women. Issue of women being killed so brutally by their spouses and we decide to come up with the idea to tackle this thing in the communities. Because oftentimes, when you pick up the papers, you would hear a neighbor say, Oh, I, knew, I, I, I know you used to be chair, but I didn't know you would have killed her. So we decided to, to go into the neighborhoods to tell people in that neighborhood where, the women, where women come from that if you see a man brutalizing or beating his woman or his, or his spouse, call the police, make a lot, a lot of noise. Yes, they have ignorant men. We're not asking you to rush in, but to raise awareness and call the police. Yes. Every girl born today should grow up without violence in her life, allowing her to flourish and become the best person she can be, according to a joint statement released by the European Union and the United Nations to mark the occasion of 16 days of activism against gender-based violence. In a statement on Thursday, the international body said that violence against women and girls is prevalent in Guyana, and this, they said, is driven by intersection of culture, economic and social factors. Local studies, they said, have indicated that 20% of women have experienced non-partner sexual abuse, while one in two women will experience intimate partner violence in their lifetime.